everybody, what's up? It's Meepa2, and welcome to another episode of my Poke Plush Living Mix. Now, if you don't know what Poke Plush Living Mix is, I'm going to be showing off my Pokemon collection of new things that I usually get. And if you play the video games, you know what a Living Mix is, where I'm trying to get a Pokemon of every single Pokemon. So from Bulbasaur to Ivysaur, I have a Bulbasaur, Ivysaur, Venusaur. And we're just going through there, trying to complete a full deck of just plushies. I'm not just sitting through these plushies, by the way. I'm trying to get a little bit of everything. Pokemon Center, Builder Bear, Sitting Cuties, Jumbos, a whole array of beautiful plushies. So I'm super excited to show off two new Jazzbird plushies I recently got. Also, you can't tell. Um, if you saw my video either a few weeks ago, I think it's going to be whenever it comes out. Um, you know this funny little guy. He's going to be here for a few episodes. He's just going to be chilling. He's just going to be chilling. So I'm super excited for him to chill here right now. That's my girlfriend's anniversary gift. Um, she loves Toxel, but the two items I have today, I'm going to be starting off with Bidoof. I have a very lovely Bidoof. Oh my gosh. He is adorable. And if you can't tell, whenever you see the tags like this, I thought they were just like Pokemon exclusives, but they're actually a Jazzwear brand, which I'm glad that I know now because whenever I update different things, I can actually start doing it as Jazzwear. But this Bidoof is cute. He has the felt teeth right here. He's just a big, chunky boy. He reminds me, even though he is not as solid, he reminds me of the Tommy plushies, like the Tommy Charger bug I have, where he's just a big, chunky boy right here. You can see his little tail. You can see this little portion. A very adorable plushie. Although I'm not a huge fan of Bidoof, I have had some decent love for him. He is my HM friend. <laughs> we'll call him HM friend for now, which if you remember the old days of Pokemon, you know that it's not him yeah we're gonna ignore that though but a very adorable he just kind of even sits pretty good over right here right now although he keeps on falling sometimes but he is a 2023 he is one of the more new recent ones and he is adorable the eyes are great the nose is kind of wonky but honestly that just might be a selling error which it sucks but he always comes with his jazz wear tag tag which I can't tell if I like these Jazzwear tags because I like having this cute little thing and you know what the Jazzwear things was. Um, he is adorable though. Very, very cool. So I'm very happy to have him in the collection. And we're gonna be moving on. Alright, and now I think I'm gonna put no, he's gonna stay right here. Oh he's falling, he's falling, the baby's falling. Let's keep him like that for now. I think I'm actually gonna put I'm trying to figure out what cute way to have the doof. Let's put him right here for now. So we have Badoof just staring there for now. But the other one that I have here, which, fun fact about Vaporeon, I do have a Jazz Wear Vaporeon fun fact about this. Whenever I got my girlfriend's anniversary gift right here from uh, Walgreens, which is a picture of us, there's our profile pictures, Pokemon characters. Very cute, by the way. If you haven't seen the anniversary video, go watch it. Go watch it. <laughs> um, but I got this from her. Or for her, at least. And whenever I was going, I was like, Walgreens has Pokemon plushies, I believe. So I went through to there. And lo and behold, a Pokemon I do not have a plush of yet. We have Vaporeon. So now, after Vaporeon, I am only missing Jolteon and Flareon. And we have the complete edition of every Evolution, which I'll do in a full Evolution video then. But a very amazing plushie right here. I love the felt, how it's cut. It feels kind of weird, but besides that, it is honestly a um, I love the blue, I love the dark blue, the yellow accents are very great, and like I said, today's episode is just about jazz wares. So a very cool plushie, this is Jazz 2023, yes, I believe this is also part of the one of the more recent new lines, it's either part of the recent line, or it's all the way back years and years ago, from like whenever the other evolution sitting down was, so a very good addition to my plush collection too, the eyes are even Perfect. The mouth makes it look so happy. Um, if I had to get a Pokemon plush of Jol or uh, Vaporeon, I was planning on getting Sitting Cuties because I think that would have been the cheapest option. But now that they're not currently in stock, that's probably the best that I have at the moment. Which is a very adorable plushie, by the way. Like I've already mentioned, it's right here. Toe beans for y'all. Just a few little toe beans, but still toe beans. Very, very cute. The tail looks great. The felt is also on the sharp felt, just going all along the back. 
that kind of looks weird of me doing that to a Vaporeon, but the tail is amazing, right here, you can see right here underneath, I just love the sitting Eevees and uh, Eevee Lucian like, line they have for Jazz Blares, all of my plushies for Eevee has been Jazz Blares, I believe, except for one from the Pokemon Center, the, oh my god, from the 2011 or something, but a very old version, which honestly, maybe I'll show you guys in the future, I have showed it off before here, numerous times, I think, actually, here, I have a Jazz Blaze Vaporeon, very amazing, hopefully, hopefully I can find a Jazz Blaze Flareon or a Jazz Blaze uh, Jolteon to add to the collection as well, if not, not a big issue, you'll find something at least the same, similar size, because I don't think I'm going to get a shooting cuties one for Jolteon or Flareon anymore, considering that would kind of look weird, but yeah, we have Vaporeon and Bidoof, so even though he's more of a normal type, we'll consider him a water type. So we got a little water type duo coming out today. Very nice. But, you know, time usually is. We gotta add them to the decks, and then we're gonna figure out where we're gonna put them. And sadly, I don't think I have a space for them out here. Maybe we'll decide to. I don't, I'm, I'm not hopeful for it. But, yeah. We're gonna add them now. <laughs> Yep, yeah, actually, you can see him. You can see Vaporeon, and you can see Badoof just chilling here. Oh, no, the Oshawott stand just fell, but that's going to be it for me, guys. Oh, no, some of the Pokemon are starting to fall. Oh, no, oh, no, oh, no. But thank you guys for watching. If you enjoyed, please make sure you like and subscribe. Let's say bye to Badoof one more time. He also wants you to subscribe. Go for it, Badoof. Say it. <coughs> All right, thank you, guys. Well, that's going to be it for me, guys. Have a lovely day, and I will see you guys next time. Peace out.